Welcome to Tech Time with me, Andrew Humphrey, and we are talking about technology and the future of grocery stores. In Atlanta, Georgia, one couple is getting high tech for their shoppers. Call it grocery shopping with a taste of technology. Oh. Welcome to Nourish and Bloom Market. Here, QR codes, automated gates, and robots run the show. Say hello. 30 ceiling cameras track your every move. And when you pick up an item, the shelf knows exactly what you chose. Once you're all finished, you just walk right out the door. So it's quite an unusual experience. This is the brainchild of first time store owners, Jillia and Jamie Hemmings. Shopping has changed overall. And we wanted to create a solution for the post pandemic era that we're living in. But even more notable than how you shop, what you're shopping for. This community is a food desert, and the closest grocery store is a 15-minute drive, even longer if you do not have access to reliable transportation. The shelves at Bloom and Nourish hold all-natural organic foods, and the customers cannot get enough. We've waited for it so long, it's, just, it's a godsend. There's even a techie spin on delivery. Two climate-controlled robots complete with their own crosswalk. The Hemmings are already planning on expanding, eyeing disadvantaged neighborhoods. And thanks to a partnership with Microsoft, it will soon become a reality. When you look at childhood obesity, when you look at diabetes, it really runs in the black community. And we want to be able to change that. Our whole mission is that everyone deserves access to healthy food in a convenient way, right? In an affordable way. This is more than a business. This is a mission. For yeah. Guys. Oh, yeah, 100%. A mission to keep healthy foods within reach. So many issues that are so pertinent to so many folks around the country. And again, the Hemmings trying to help by adding technology to their grocery store. Now, Nourish and Bloom is looking to expand within Georgia and outside of Georgia to Florida. I-75 connects Atlanta and Georgia. Who knows? They may expand further because they want to be across the country. So you might see one popping up right here in Detroit or in southeast Michigan. That's Tech Time with me, Andrew Humphrey. Back over to you. Wow, that is so neat. It is neat and, and so important that we have access to those things for so many people. For sure, anything to make us eat a little healthier. Absolutely.